because Squamax is a freeway, the bands can twist off. So I just want to show your workaround. If you have your belt perfectly straight and not twisted, it isn't an issue. But I know in busy gyms, you don't want to be dealing with the band coming off. Let me show you real quickly. I include one of these 22 inch straps. Let me show it. All you have to do, I have four bands on there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hook it onto here, pull as tight as I can. And then I'm literally gonna lock, I'm gonna go under the bands so that I, I, I can grab them right here. I'm gonna go under the bands, bring it up around the, the guide rod. And then once it's there, I'm gonna hook it onto the other side. This will eliminate all of the band issues. So I leave bands on there all the time if I'm using them. And this is all you have to do. The plate goes right over top. I'll show you some, uh, some video of it. Now, I've got the strap on there that prevents the bands from twisting off. And look, this is the worst case scenario. I'm twisting the belt every which way using two carabiners. And I just want to show you there will be no issue with the bands twisting. So that's the band strap. You can watch. It'll want to twist, but it won't. I'm just going to do some reps. Try to bottom out everything. So as you can see, it'll always stay straight. The band strap going across is keeping anything from twisting. So I showed you how the band strap prevents twisting. You wouldn't have any twist if you keep the belt straight. Let me just show you what a straight belt is. So I have it on loop three and, and my belt's not twisted. Let me show you, just show you this. There will never be a twist. The bands won't twist if the belt's straight. But, like I said, if you don't want to deal with it, put that band strap, that band strap around, and be done with it.